All right, guys, let's talk about appraisals. One of the things we're seeing right now is appraisals that are actually getting in the way of us getting our clients the highest sales price possible. Now, give you an example. So we had a house, we listed it for, let's call it 900,000. The most expensive house in the neighborhood sold for 925, but it was larger with a larger lot, maybe not quite as nice, but definitely bigger. So we were in it when we ended up at a 975 offer, we knew we were gonna have a little bit of a fight with the appraiser to get the number up, to get our seller the most money possible. So just to put that in perspective, we're trying to sell a home more expensive than any other home has ever been sold in that community, and it's a little bit smaller than the highest comp. Guess what? We did it. So how did we do it? It's a couple of different ways. One, when we come out and sit with you and learn about your home and learn about the features you have and learn about all the things that make your home great, our sales pitch to a buyer is very similar to our sales pitch to an appraiser. Yes, we meet with every appraiser face to face and help them get the value as high as humanly possible. So we use all the things that you've done to make your house shine so that we can get the most expensive appraisal so then we can get you the most amount of money. Now, in this particular case, we couldn't get to the 975, but guess what? When we negotiated the offer, we got what's called an appraisal gap. So we got a buyer to agree that whatever it appraised for, they would go $50,000 above that number. It appraised for 925 and we got 975 at closing. So if you're working with the right agent, and they understand the market and where we are right now, you can get the most money for your house right now. Give us a call, happy to help.